Thanks. So for the people that aren't um, aren't aware of WP and Up, can you give us a good overview of how that came about and what the mission of WP and Up is? Yeah, sure. So a um, bit of history. Back in 2014, um, I, I felt the need. I wanted to, to deliver something to the community um, that um, initially I wanted to support individuals that are struggling with addiction, um, whether that's drink, drug, uh, various forms of addiction. Um, it's something that's quite close to my heart. It's something that I've, I've wanted to deliver for many years prior to even being involved in, within the WordPress community. Um, and I kind of started down that path and it felt very, very big. Um, it was, how do I do this? Where do I even start? Um, and as I went on, it, I just kept pushing it back. It, I, I kind of I need to focus on my business. I need to focus on myself. There was always a reason. There was always something else um, for me to, to be focused on. Um, over the years, uh, so running the, the various meetups, having conversations with people, I just I, I, uh, realized and recognized that there was this 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 uh, need for something uh, to support people from a from a kind of a healthy uh, um, mental health perspective. Back end of last year, um, I, so back end of twenty seventeen, um, I brought together what are uh, what are now the the core of the trustees of the nonprofit. Uh, we sat down together and we said, look, what is this? What does this look like? We, we sat down. I think we, it was a good six hour meeting. We just walked, we just walked through the theories, the concepts um, from my kind of original seed of this, this nonprofit supporting um, uh, individuals with addiction. And we really drilled down and realized that at the core of everything we were talking about was mental health. Um, so we decided we needed to, to progress. Um, we, Started the process of registering as a um, charity here in the UK. Um, although we are we are um, looking, we are offering global support. It's not just in the UK, um, but we need we are. I'm UK based as as are the trustees, uh, the other trustees. Um, so we registered. We went through that process of registering. Uh, it took us about 21, 22 weeks. Um, there was an awful lot that went into that. Um, at the same time, we also started um, just doing a very, very little bit of marketing. Um, it was We weren't even really thinking of it as marketing. It was just a case of we wanted to kind of say, hello, this is what we're thinking of bringing to the community. This is what we're wanting to do. Um, we weren't really kind of marketing any service or, or, or product or anything like that at all. Um, we put together the, the original press forward video, um, which we had many of many members of the community uh, get on board and support. Um, and we actually received a, a real flood of uh, individuals coming forward and saying that they they needed support, they needed help um, with with their, their mental health. Um, it was an unintended consequence because uh, yeah. we weren't we weren't prepared we didn't have uh, the services uh, the the infrastructure in place to be able to deliver any kind of support um, but we we couldn't simply just ignore these individuals that were were stepping up uh, were coming forward um, so we we looked at and asked what could we do how could we deliver some form of support um, without being funded uh, and we looked at de delivering kind of mentorship and companionship, uh, which we've been doing over the last twelve months. We had uh, we've had about three and a half thousand hours uh, donated to us um, by uh, various volunteers. We've got about twenty four volunteers involved in the project at the moment, um, delivering about that we've delivered uh, a little over eight hundred hours um, of uh, support to people reaching out to us over the twelve months, um, and. All of this has been achieved completely unfunded. We've we've got a number of services that we are wanting to develop uh, and deliver, which include uh, the incorporation of professional mental health uh, professionals, um, uh, professional mental health experts. So, of course, that comes at a cost, um, and that's where at this stage we're now looking for funding. Uh, looking to deliver this service uh, we want to combine the kind of expertise of the the kind of WordPress community the, the expertise of uh, understanding running a WordPress business um, being a WordPress designer being a WordPress developer uh, freelancer uh, with the professional mental health services as well um, so it's a bit of a bit of a hybrid um, of the, of the, uh, the two skills and two uh, well, multiple skill sets uh, together to deliver support.